If you like our video, click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses and training materials, visit us at teachucomp.com. The Selection Brush Tool is a selection tool that gives a more natural feel of painting on a canvas when making a selection. With this tool, you can either paint the pixels you want to select or the pixels you don't want to select. To enable this tool, choose the Selection Brush Tool from the Toolbox and, if necessary, the Tool Options bar. In the Tool Options bar, select whether the tool will add or subtract from the selection by clicking the desired Add to Selection or Subtract from Selection button. The default behavior is Add. Use the View as a Selection or a Mask dropdown to the right of that to choose whether to apply a selection or a mask to the pixels you are about to select. Choose Selection to paint pixels you want to select, or choose Mask to paint pixels you don't want to select. If you choose Mask, you will also be required to choose an overlay color. An overlay is a layer of color shown on the screen only that shows the unselected areas. You can use the default red color or choose your own by clicking into the color picker that appears. In addition, you must also set the overlay opacity by using the overlay slider or entering a percentage into the adjacent field. Finally, select a brush from the Brush Presets Picker, set a brush size, and adjust the hardness. Next, use this tool to paint the pixels you want to select or not select in the image depending on which mode you chose. As you paint in selection mode, you will see a selection border appear. Every brush stroke will add to the selection. If you accidentally select pixels you don't want to include, press and hold down the Alt key on your keyboard and then paint over the mistakenly selected area. Note that if you choose to paint in mask mode, remember that you are choosing the pixels that you don't want to select. When you are done painting in mask mode, simply choose selection from the mode drop-down list or choose another tool in the toolbox to turn your mask into a selection border. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. Get ad-free courses at teachucomp.com.